Oh, one um, word of advice or uh, tip I forgot to tell you guys. Before I did the starting motor uh, test troubleshooting, um, I disconnected all the spark plugs. So this way it's guaranteed the motor is not going to start uh, running and uh, because I didn't hook up the water hose. So that's the way you try to troubleshoot the starting motor or the solenoid. Right now I think solenoid is my problem because I'm only getting 1.2 volts, 1.3 volts. Um, so it's a, it's, a, it's a part that costs only 20 bucks, so that's what I'm going to do. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to troubleshoot this bottom um, terminal and, okay, Brian, crank it again. Alright, this is only seven. Alright, sorry, do that again. Alright, it's 8.5, 8.0, 8.2, 8 8.6, yeah. No good. Okay, stop. Um, let me do this. Alright, so without uh, cranking the motor, it's 12.2 uh, right now. Oh, actually, I got to reverse. So I'm connecting the uh, solenoid uh, positive terminal to the start uh, terminal. Well, wow. right now it's dropped down to uh, only 2.9. Whoa. That's weird. Oh, now. Good, good. It's it's back to 12.3. Okay, crank the motor. Whoa. Drop down to 1.2, 1.5, 1.6. 1 wow. No wonder. Okay, stop. Yeah, see, as soon as we release it, it's 12.1, 12.5, 12.17. But um, this uh, solenoid may be the problem. Okay, uh, crank it again. Wow, it's only 1.3, 1.2, 1.3. Okay, I think we've found the problem.